Hi everyone, so in today's story, um, David does some bad things, but God still forgives him. And also in our story, there's a lady who's bathing in a pool in her courtyard. And so, when you're in the bath, you might like to play with bubbles. So today, we're going to make bubble paintings. So to make your bubble painting, you will need some paper, and um, you can use any colour you want, I have white and yellow. You will need a cup or a bowl or some kind of container, some washing up liquid, some paint, um, you can use any paint that you might have and any colour that you might have, and some water. So, first of all, we're going to get our cup and put some paint into um, your cup. Just a large dollop of paint. And then we're going to get our washing up liquid. And we're going to put some of that in there. And then we're going to pour a little bit of water. So the cup's about a quarter full. And then we're going to mix um, mix it all up with one of our straws. You may need a little bit more um, washing up liquid or water, but it should be just enough so that you can blow bubbles in it, which I'll show you now. So once you have your mixture, um, you're going to you're going to blow some bubbles. So remember to blow down into the cup rather than suck it up like you normally would do with, through a straw because that might not taste very nice. So. You're going to blow the bubbles so they're coming over the edge of the cup. Then you're going to get your paper and you're just going to lay it gently on the top of your bubbles so that hopefully you might have some patterns um, once you lift it up because the bubbles will pop and the paint should go on your paper. It might not work very well to begin with but it's fun just to have an experiment so we're going to try it again and we're going to lay the paper on again so that they can be a bit faint but you can try and get some um, different patterns. You could also, if you want to, um, take the straw out of your cup and try blowing bubbles straight onto your paper. It doesn't always work, sometimes it just makes a splatter of paint. But you can have fun trying with different patterns. You could also, if you do it in a bowl, like this, and lay your paper on top then you should get slightly different um, patterns. They're a bit wider than the other ones. So you can try um, using a bowl cup and you can also try with different colours. I have green, red and pink here. They didn't work too well but um, you can have a go with whatever you may have. Just have a bit of fun and experiment. Um, yeah, so have fun. Bye!